Okay, so this presentation is to try and help you look at your Highbury College emails. We know that you have your own private emails, like Outlook or Gmail or Hotmail, things like that. But some of you just don't have emails at all. And if we don't have your proper email address, then we can't contact you. But you all have a Highbury College email. You possibly just have forgotten how to look at your emails, but it's really, really easy. So here we go. This is how you do it. Right. First thing you do. Go on to your web browser on your computer or your phone or your laptop, you know, Google, Yahoo, anything like that and type in Highbury College. OK, second thing. When you get to the main Highbury College site, right of the top on the very first page, look for the section that says Student Hub. There you go. There's an example there on the on the screen. All you need to do is click on the word Student Hub. So now what you'll get is a page with lots and lots of information. All you need to do is look for the section that says Office 365, just like it has there in the picture. And at the bottom, you've got Go to Office. So then what you do, click on that. So what happens next is you'll get something that looks like what you can see in the picture. It'll say Welcome to Office. And then you've got a red box that says Sign In. So what you have to do then, click on that. So now you need to remember your student number because what you have to do is in the sign in part, then you write your college email address. Now, if you don't know what your college email address, then all you do is you put your student number and then at students.hybrid.ac.uk just like it has in the picture there but where the black box is that's where you put your student number if you don't know your student number ask your teacher because they can tell you but most of you know your student numbers so that's what you do first right the next thing you need to do is put your password in. Now, this is your college password. So if you can't remember what that is, because some of you haven't used the emails before or you've just forgotten it, don't worry. Ask your teacher. So email them or phone them or send them a text message to say, I, I need my student password and they can let you know because it's your student password you have to put in the next part. Right, so once you've put your password in, it's possible, not always, but it might say that you have to give more information. Don't worry, that's okay, we will tell you how. So all you need to do is press the next button like it has in the picture. Right, so what you now need to do is you need to put your telephone number. So just like it has in the picture, see where the black box is, write your telephone number into that box and then you need to choose the little thing that says send me a code by text message. So just click on the round circle where they arrow, like the red arrow says, send me a code by text message. OK, once you've done that, you'll get a text message. It will come to your phone and the message will have a six number code. What you have to do is you type those six numbers into the box just like it has in the picture 
there's a box you type the six numbers in there and then you'll see a button that says verify if you click on the verify button after that okay so the last thing when you've put the code in hopefully you should now get to your Microsoft account and you'll see at the side of the page a lot of little pictures what you need to do is click on the one like it has in the picture there that's got an O that's your outlook your emails and when you open that you will get emails from your teacher and you can send your teacher emails as well so you don't need to use Gmail or Hotmail or Yahoo you can use your phone if you want and you can still contact your teacher so hopefully if you follow all of these steps in this presentation you will be able to send emails and get emails from your teacher if you can't then tell your teacher let them know and then we'll see if we can help you okay good luck